stretch for Northeastern that's propelled them to second in the conference. Bolden Brace on the drive, good feed. Pushitsa over the top of the league's top shot block. The toughness of Northeastern's defense, and the Huskies didn't really shoot the ball all that well until the second half and then really pulled away. Here's Green down the lane from the lead for the Huskies. Justin Pierce inside. Adige wants three. He's got it. Can get up at six foot four. Wow. Danelle Gresham Jr. for three. It's back in the game. He's picked up Anthony Green. So he missed about eight minutes of game time with the ankle injury. Roland wants it again. He's got defense, but Knight, because he just injured his foot, doesn't have the mobility to get out there and challenge the shot. Good feed and finish. First two for Pierce. Bill Canal, he's picked up a couple of rebounds since. Knight at Miller. Ankle looks just fine. 14, now it's an eight point game. Penetration brace over Adige through contact. Though Roland and Knight both played public high school basketball in Syracuse. They never played each other in a regular high school game. Denell Gresham Jr. not. There's Pushitsa taking it away from Pierce on the cut. Vasa runs the break. Roland for three. No. Yes! Oh, it bounced back! Now you have to guard Knight out here. He's made nine three-pointers this season. Blows past Green and sticks in two more. Tough thing, Patrick, is when you guard him at the three-point line. Shimmy Shake rolling. Sets up Green. He thunders down his third slam. All created by the big man coming down the lane. No one wants to challenge that shot. What a great find from Roland. Lowy in tight. Muscles it through. Into the corner, Chase Adige. Slithers it inside to Pierce for two. Rowley slings it in for Knight. One year of tuition, including all of his undergrad and his three years of law school. No wonder he got a degree <laughs> in finance. There's a rip away steal. Adige off to the races. Murphy in tight, working on Knight. Roland looking for his fourth three. Knight's there for another rebound. That's his eighth to go along with 11 points. Adi straight to the 10. Presence, everything is around the arc right now. Adi staying in with three fouls. So Tony Shaver showing his freshman some faith. Thomas Murphy. That's when you can dump the basketball down low and really take advantage. It's just one on the shot clock. Pushitsa gets it to go! To the rim. Adige having himself a night too. 14 points leading the way for the tribe. Pushitsa right back to the basket. All that he basically passed to himself. And one, LJ Owens. William and Mary keeps on a hang. Pierce with seven. Outside Milan. Finally on the board. Took him. Could have been Evaldi. Any other one of those flamethrowers. Up top, Green's got the alley oop. Let the tribe get as close as seven twice in this half, but no closer. Pierce on the back door beats the defense, set it full. Previous possession, they took 27 off the game clock. They got it down to 10 on the shot clock now. Pushitsa on the drive, finds Murphy. There's a dagger. 90 seconds to go. Husky. Huskies will stay strong in second place in the CAA after the season sweep over the Tribe. Turnovers, I think that's all you really need to say about this one. The Tribe could not hang on to the basketball. They kept getting closer and closer, but in those key moments, those swing moments, as you mentioned, Bill, they couldn't hang on to it or the Husky defense was